Hi everybody, Homebrew Help with you today, and now I'm going to be showing you how to put custom songs into your new Super Mario Bros. Wii. And for this we're going to need a few things. We're going to be needing a Wii Scrubber, we're going to be needing Brawl Custom Song Maker GUI, and WBFS Manager or some other way to load your ISOs onto your Wii without having to waste a disk. Now we're going to start off by opening up a Wii Scrubber. And load the uh, load your newer Super Mario Bros. Wii ISO. Make sure it's a copied version of your regular new Super Mario Bros. Wii. Here's my regular one, and this says copy on it. I'm going to be using that, and you do too in case you accidentally mess up or something like that. And scroll down and open up the sound folder, and then stream. We're going to scroll down to stage to strm underscore bgm underscore menu. This is the only one I've been able to figure out because unfortunately the files inside the folder are all in the native Japanese language and I have absolutely no idea what some of those are saying. So uh, now we're going to go into our Brawl Custom Song Maker and just for the sake of showing you how to use this I'll delete one of the songs I'm going to use. We'll go to Add and then Add to Queue then we're going to go to our wherever you save your music, wherever the f f song you want to use is, and then you choose your song. You have to give it a sec to show up, and there it is. Make sure your loop is checked, and convert it to BRSTM, which is the type of file that most Nintendo games use in their games. It's the ones that are that are used in Brawl. If you've ever done any Brawl music hacking, this should seem really familiar to you. And once it's finished processing and finalizing and everything like that, X out. And I'm going to be using the inter-party system, don't stop. And make sure, you don't need to do anything right here, this is only for Brawl. Uh, search for your where the Brawl Custom Song Maker is, I'm going to be searching... What should I search? I'll search br.brstm. And here's the song I want to use, so we're just going to right-click it and open file location. And as you can see, it's on my desktop, BCSM GUI library, and it's right there. So we're going to open up Wii Scrubber. We're going to right-click the BGM menu, and we're going to right-click it and click Replace. I'm going to go to the desktop, and as you can see, it's in BCM, so we're going to type B. There we go and a library and inner party system don't stop is the song I'm going to be using just because I think it's a good title song for some reason and let it replace and then it's going to reparse Wii Scrubber which basically means it's going to reload the ISO after you've made an edit to it now reparsing and now that it's all done you can just close Wii Scrubber yes you can close all this and now you're going to need WBFS Manager or whatever it is you happen to use. Make sure that your drive is formatted for playing games. Okay, I'm gonna go to we're gonna go to WBFS Browse, and then we're going to make sure we use the edit the copy file. It's going to read it and it's just gonna load it up here. And then we're going to click WBFS Drive again and then Add to Drive. And I'm going to skip this part because it always takes forever. Okay, and now that it's finished adding the entries to your drive, you can just take it out and head over to your Wii and just use your Neo Gamma or your USB loader or whatever it is you use to play your US USBs or your backups. Alright, and now that we're ready, we're going to go to our Wii, and we're heading over to USB Loader, or whatever it is you plan on using. And there's our new Super Mario Bros. Wii. Remember, it will say just new Super Mario Bros. Wii, even though it's the uh, edited ISO we used. Thank <laughs> you.
and it should do right here. And there we go, I'm not sure if you can hear that, let me turn the volume up for you. It starts off really slow, but... And there you have it. This is the edited music. This is the only screen I know of for the uh, code, for the uh, Wii Scrubber. If any of you guys can uh, come up with like a chart or something like that that'll give out uh, for each different stage or something like that, that would be greatly appreciated for everybody. Oh, and a little side note, this music will stop after a certain amount of time. I, I, my guess would be maybe 30, 45 seconds is a rough estimation. So, thank you guys for watching. This is Homebrew Help, just to show you that it works. And there's where the music fades out. Otherwise, it would have kept playing. And there you go. Everything's normal, and we'll just head back to the title screen. And there it is. So, thanks for watching, you guys.